It's the burner, man. Back with burner talks. And it seems like the Minnesota Timberwolves have made a big mistake in my opinion. Before I get into what I mean, it'll be greatly appreciated if you guys can hit that like button. Also, consider subscribing if you like NBA takes and NBA news. But let's go ahead and get into it. It seems like Rudy Gobert and the Minnesota Timberwolves have solidified their partnership by agreeing to a three-year contract extension valued at 110 million. As a part of this deal, Gobert has decided to decline his 46 point six million player option for the 25 26 season opting instead for a fresh contract that benefits both parties um so in the comment section you guys let me know what you think about this do you think rudy gobert is worth that much money do you think the minnesota timberwolves should have gave him a contract extension let me know all these things um but let me give you guys my take uh first things first I mean, you don't have to pay him 46 mil this year. Um, it drops down to, what, 30-something million. So I guess that's a small W, a small hand clap in this situation. Y'all can't hear me clapping right now because that's how much of a, a, a hand clap that this is right now. But um, in my opinion, man, um, for the Timberwolves, I don't like, I don't like this. You know, over the last couple of years, um, I didn't get why Shaq – and Charles Barkley was so hard on Rudy Gobert. I was just, I thought like, bro, why are y'all all on Rudy Gobert, bro? Like y'all just, y'all seem like some old dudes just bitter and hating on Rudy Gobert. Then the last year or so, I've been watching Rudy Gobert and, and his, their assessment of Rudy Gobert is, I feel like, fair. Um, Rudy Gobert, he has four defensive player of the years. Shouldn't have won it last year. Um, he's not the best defensive player. He's not better than Bam defensively. He's not better than AD. Them guys can, can guard the one through five um, or anybody like that. When he's in space, he looks like he's looking for the help. I need help, please. Like, he can't guard anybody out there. And in my opinion, you're paying 30-something million for a guy that has the basic package, the basic center package. You know, when you think about what every center should be able to do in the NBA, what you should be able to do, you should be able to rebound protect the rim decently and be pretty have good hands decent hands and finish around the rim Rudy Gobert can't even do all of that you know he can defend decently at the rim and he, and he can rebound yeah he doesn't have great hands he can't finish I just watched last year they put Luka Dantage Luka Dantage and Kyrie Irving we're guarding this man in the Western Conference Finals, and he could not make them pay. He could not finish. They tried that same thing with Przingis, and what did the Przingis do in the Finals? He killed them, made them get out of that lineup. So you're telling me you're seven feet tall, and you can't finish and make people pay. You can't do any matchups. You can not You can barely catch, catch the ball when they dump it down to you. you. You're fumbling in it. You can't finish. Like, bro, you do basic stuff. As a center, bro, and you're getting paid thirty million. Who valued this man at that much? You got rookies that come in li lively. Lively can do what you do, bro. Respectfully, lively can do what you do, and he doesn't make even half the money you make. So I don't think this is a dub, man. I do not. You, now you're gonna be stuck with this man. Nobody's gonna trade for Rudy Gobert, man. You're just gonna be stuck with this bad contract. I feel like. Why didn't you try to ship him and keep Carl Anthony Towns? Y'all just said I couldn't keep Carl Anthony Towns because of the contract, but you just give this man a contract extension. Make it make sense. You should have traded this man and kept Towns, bro. Towns is way better than this man. But it is what it is at this point. We will see how this contract ends up faring up. Uh, in the next couple of years. Again, you guys let me know what do you think about this contract extension. Do you think he deserved it? Do you think I'm being too harsh on Rudy Gobert? Again, also don't forget to like up the video and subscribe if you're new. And y'all already know who it is. <laughs>